A rogue planet is a body that is about the mass and radius of a, of a planet in our solar system, but instead of orbiting a star, it actually orbits the galaxy. The WISE spacecraft is a satellite launched by NASA to survey the night sky in the infrared wavelengths of the electromagnetic spectrum. Infrared wavelengths are wavelengths that are beyond what we can see with our own eyes. So if you imagine a rainbow, they would basically be colors beyond red. During its year-long mission, WISE scanned the entire cosmos searching for anything that emitted infrared light. This included everything from asteroids in our own solar system to extremely distant galaxies halfway across the universe. During its scans of the sky, some objects were observed to be extremely cold, something like only the temperature of the Earth is today. If something is the temperature of the Earth, it's probably not a star. Stars are much, much hotter. So since these objects were cold, it led many scientists to believe that these were in fact rogue planets. Many of the missions that NASA launches and surveys that are conducted from the ground tend to focus on very small patches of the sky. But what was great about WISE was that it was actually able to look at the entire sky and actually take this great census of all the rogue planets that are near the Earth. Prior to the launch of WISE, rogue planets were actually hypothesized as a population of the galaxy based on our observations of known extrasolar planetary systems. A lot of these systems look very different from our own. As a result of that, you might expect then that there would be planets no longer bound to their stars but instead freely roaming the galaxy. And what WISE was able to do for the first time was find evidence for these ejected planets, these lost siblings of these uh, f formed solar systems. And it was really exciting for a lot of astronomers to finally have direct evidence that these free-floating rogue planets were actually out there. And from now, we can go on and start to try and piece the story together even more and understand how the Earth formed and what our position in the cosmos actually is.